a couple of days ago I made a short video like 46 seconds I think it was of how to make a magic red there's no such thing as a magic red how do you make a magic red take three Echeveria Pearl von Nonberg can of white oil spray wash it off with soapy water let's compare the two Echeveria Pearl von Nonberg Echeveria magic red hello there my name is Liz, a self-confessed succulent addict. Welcome to my channel, Growing Succulents. The first magic red I made is this plant. <laughs> this was the original plant that was sprayed with white oil. But this magic here, this is Echeveria Pearl Von Nonberg. These ones are Romeo, so three different looks. My Romeo has got little spots, so that one is a darker Romeo, more like an ebony edge, and that one is also like an ebony, and the center one is just pink. And also with a really bright red edge. Now, this PVN, or my Pearl von Nonberg, that was my first created, <laughs> magic red has grown it used to be uh has grown i think there were eight or seven uh, there's another stump here there's another more so one two three four five six seven there were seven stumps that grew from one plant so i sprayed it with the white oil because it got attacked by mealybug and then the plant died after spraying the white oil it died it lasted for about six months and then it slowly ate itself so it can't sustain itself it just kept dying and dying and dying and eventually it died but I left it and I went away for a trip and when I came back got all this I just hope I can find a footage or a photo of what it looks like before but anyway so because I haven't changed this arrangement for a couple of years now now and look at the beauty beautiful like nice and thick and fat it's almost like a fat Douglas hut or a hut pink so this plant can this succulents or Echeveria, Graptoveria, Pachyveria depending on how it's grown they can look very similar or very different from their mother plant and by the way I'm just going to show you the one that I sprayed a couple of days ago so this is my magic red on that short video a couple of days ago. So you can see the PVN with no sprays and the one that's been sprayed. The color stays, it will stay, but eventually it will stop growing. And actually it can also handle the sun because right now it's still sort of the UV uh, rays are still sort of lower. So it doesn't really affect them. It gives them time to acclimatize to the sun for summer because summer sun in here is just really scorching it really burns you and the plants are the same they have time to adjust and get used to their environment now this one here now I came here two days two nights ago or two mornings ago I came here at five o'clock just to look at <laughs> in the dark <laughs> to look at my succulents when I want to and then I walked past and I saw there was bite marks so I got one two three there's another one here so something ate it so we don't uh, we don't have rats here I've never seen a rat but we do have a couple of mouse and maybe mouse came in at night and ate it so there's still left over of little bits there where it had to go i had to look at the other plants none of the other plants was touched only this one got touched so something about maybe the soap that smells nice or the white oil that it likes so it had a couple of goes and didn't like it but nevertheless it already damaged my poor magic red which is actually a pvm so if you were to ask me whether i should make a magic red or not me personally i wouldn't make a magic red or i'm telling you please don't don't make a magic red but after seeing this beautiful gorgeous whatever's left six now of this 
PVN former magic red version now I'm gonna be sitting on the fence on these ones guys so anyway that's all I'm gonna leave you with so whether you should make one or not it's entirely up to you I'm not telling you to make one and I'm not telling you not to make one but for me fortunately it worked out but sometimes if it doesn't work out then you're gonna end up with a dead plant okay guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the next video